Hi, I'm Carlo Mancatelli of Time2 Resources. This video will help you to understand profit and links to presentations on costs and revenues. If you want to make notes whilst following the video, why not download the handy PDF note taker? The link can be found in the description box below. In economics, we're fond of using synonyms for a variety of terms. For example, the production possibility curve and the production possibility frontier in the same manner, we have two synonyms that we use when looking at different types of cost. Explicit costs are the same as total costs. They are all of the fixed and variable costs in aggregate. They are costs that we can monetarize, and they involve a payment to a third party. They are actual costs and will include rent, wages, raw materials and other supplies. Implicit costs are the opportunity costs that a firm gives up when not using its factors of production in alternative employment. For example, if I gave up a job earning £20,000 and took on a new job earning £30,000, the opportunity cost or implicit cost would be the £20,000 that I was giving up. As well as having new types of cost, we also have new terms for profit. Accounting profit is the difference between total revenue and total costs. We can use the term explicit cost instead of total cost. So we have a new formula, accounting profit equals total revenue minus explicit cost. Let's take a scenario of a firm operating in a market, making and selling wooden furniture, such as tables. Last year it had total revenue of £80,000 and total costs of £60,000. Remember, we can use the term explicit costs as a synonym for total costs. So the firm had explicit costs of £60,000. We can see that the firm made an accounting profit of £20,000. Economic profit is total revenue minus total cost minus opportunity cost. If we use our new terms for total cost and opportunity costs, we have a new formula. Total revenue minus explicit costs minus implicit costs. This takes into account both the monetary cost and the opportunity cost. Imagine the firm selling wooden furniture decided to change the use of its factors of production. Instead of making wooden furniture, it moves into the growing market for bespoke window frames. There is an opportunity cost of £20,000. The profit that the firm gave up from making wooden furniture. Let's say the move is a success and it makes total revenue of £90,000 with explicit or total costs of £65,000. We can see that the firm made an accounting profit of £25,000 and an economic profit of £5,000. Normal profit is that level of profit required for a firm to stay in its current operations. Normal profit occurs when economic profit equals zero. Suppose the firm had undertaken some research into costs, revenues and profits in order to decide whether it should change from wooden furniture to bespoke window frames. It came up with the following data. Firstly, we have the actual figures from last year. Here, the firm made an accounting profit of £20,000. However, for the window frames, it forecast explicit costs to be £70,000 rather than £65,000. The opportunity cost of moving from wooden furniture to window frames is the £20,000 profit that the firm would forego by the move. From a financial point of view, when we take into account the loss of the accounting profit when it made wooden furniture, the firm is no better off. If it moved into making window frames, it would have an economic profit of £0. As normal profit occurs when economic profit equals zero, there would have been no point in the firm changing markets.
Thank you for watching and listening to this video. Costs, revenues and supernormal profits are covered on separate videos. If you haven't already done so, why not subscribe to the Time2Resources YouTube channel now?